coming up. It's the big boys with the big toys. The greatest show on wheels, MTN Monster Truck Nation Monster Truck Challenge Series is back. And we got the biggest lineup of trucks so far. The question is, who's going to... Who's going to come out as the victor? Will it be returning competitor Fred Schaefer and Barefoot? First time coming into this series, a true veteran, Eldon DePew, driving Jack Wilman Sr.'s Taurus? Or will it be Dan, or will it be returning competitor Dan Rutte, driving Bob and Marilyn Chandler's Bigfoot? Dennis Anderson in the Grave Digger? Or anybody out of these 20 trucks that 20 trucks that we have here tonight. It's all it will be decided in a in a 20 truck shootout next on MTN battling it out on a classic St. Louis style course. Welcome to another edition of MTN Monster Truck Challenge Series. Series, we got a great show for you tonight. Hello everyone, my name is Tom Todd and we have and we have got the biggest lineup of trucks yet. This, yet, but this, tonight's a special. Ten, it is the Thanksgiving Fight Under the Lights. The last event before the 24 truck shoot, before the playoffs which will feature 24 truck shootouts with 16 other competitors battling it out with top eight in the points we got a, we got a great st louis style racing track for you today for you today and we got the biggest lineup of trucks so Lineup of trucks. Here, here's the field. Dan Rutte driving the famous big blue Ford Bigfoot. Foot. This is the new. This is one of the new, newer Bigfoot trucks. Next, next competitor, David Byers, a, a young gun driving the Snake Bite Ford. He'll be be Bigfoot's running mate tonight. Next up, David Morris, a returning competitor in the Equalizer Chevrolet. Next up is a fur. Next couple of guys, our first timers, will have J.R. McNeil in Raisin Cane, a Dodge out of Florida, and then Ed Eckert in Full Bore. Next up, next up, we've one guy we've seen before, one guy we've haven't. Alan Pizzo and Predator out of Brentwood, Tennessee, and his and his cousin and running mate Dave Pizzo driving Prowler. Next up is another first timer on this series. Joe Cipher out of Reno, Nevada, an airborne ranger, is physically handicapped, uses all hand controls. Next up, out of Milton, Florida, here's Jim Jack and the Reptoid. Then ne our next competitor, Dan Patrick. Patrick in Mr. in the truck that I would love that I always would love to call Mr. Biceps out of Kingston, Ohio, in the Samson. Next up, Tony Farrell out of North Vernon, Indiana, driving with the with the Detroit based base team, driving the built Ford Tough Blue Thunder. Next up, Mark Hall, the Executioner Dodge out of Champaign, Illinois, and then next up is the most popular truck in the world, Dennis Anderson, driver of the Grave Digger, 
And then next up is, is also a crowd favorite, Bobby Zollner and the Monster Mutt. Next up, still out of Fra another returning competitor out of Frackville, Pennsylvania. Here's John Seasock in Sudden Impact, and and here's a, a first time timer on this series. Truck truly a veteran, veteran on on the monster truck racing circuit. The third monster truck ever to be created, created by Jack Wilman. He. His nephew will be driving it. Elder DePew driving Taurus. Next up will be Darren Basil and King Crunch, and then, then, our, and then the next three guys are returning competitors: Gary Porter and the Carolina Crusher out of Wadesboro, North Carolina, out of Blackwell, Missouri. We have Guy Wood driving the Big Bad Bull, known as the Bulldozer, and last but certainly not least. In the blue Chevrolet. And what what is tonight a blue Chevrolet returning after a few months off looking for success here in a success here at a pontoon beach, Illinois, not far from Jack Wilman to Wilman's Taurus right there. Fred Schaefer and Barefoot. And yes, I do realize that's a little sloppy, but here's the first round matchups. Samson will be taking on Full Bore. Bigfoot will be taking on Predator. Bulldozer against Raisin Kane. Reptoid will be paired up against Carolina Crusher. Snakebite will be paired up against Prowler. Executioner up against Blue Thunder. Then we'll have Monster Mutt taking on Grave Digger. Digger Taurus up against King Crunch. Equalizer paired up against Airborne Ranger. And Sudden Impact will be paired up against Barefoot. And before we do begin the racing action, Alex had something to say. Hey, Monster Truck fans, Alex here. I have a little family emergency to attend to, so I will not be here for the racing portion. But however, not all hope is lost. All hope is not lost. However. I have the legendary Sonic Nick take my place for the racing portion. However, I will be back for the freestyle. Style. Tom, be nice to him. Sonic, get along with him. Get along with him. Get along with him. So Sega's legendary Sonic the Hedgehog is good. Is our newest member of our broadcast team. It. Team, it is a pleasure to have him w up here with us. Have him with us, and uh, as we get ready to go racing with Dan Patrick and Sampson taking on Ed Eckert and Full Bore. They are off, coming across the the six car jump. Now they got to make a wide turn. Remember, compare in contrast to the U turn in obstacle courses, you got to. Where you gotta make a tight hairpin turn on a St. Louis style course, you gotta make a wide turn. As the, as the two turning poles clearly show that coming across the dirt bump, it'll be an easy win for Dan Patrick in the Sampson machine. He'll be going on the first. He'll be he'll be putting full bore on the trailer and putting. And advancing into the second round, round beautifully executed jump over the cars. Cars, may I add in, as Full Bore finally uh, gets across the finish line there. All right, who will join Sampson? Will it be the legend? Will it be Dan Runce and the legendary Bigfoot? Or will it be Alan Pizzo and Predator? They are off. They are already off the start line, coming across the cars. Cars beautifully executed turn by Dan Runty and Bigfoot. Foot. It, Bigfoot way in the lead at this point. Point. He's coming around already, making a making his final turn. Can Predator catch up? It's gonna be hard. It is going to be really hard. 
hard. Predator a little out of shape coming to the to the second jump. Second car jump and Bigfoot already across the finish line. Bigfoot's the winner. Predator hit a turning pylon. He is disqualified and he is out of this competition. Predator is, will be heading back to Brentwood, Tennessee. He still got his teammate uh, Dave Pizzo and Prowler though. Though look at big look at that finish line jump from Bigfoot. Beautifully executed. More round one racing action coming up. Coming up next. Stay tuned. 